October is National Breast Cancer Awareness Month. According to health officials, one in eight women in the United States will develop breast cancer in her lifetime. The Public Health Clinic of Delta and Menominee counties is offering free screenings to, to women in underserved populations. TV6's Escanaba Bureau reporter Yona Gavino has the story. It's called the Breast and Cervical Cancer Control Program. And last year, the public health clinic saw 453 clients. It's very, very important to catch anything, any kind of cancer early. So our, our, to me, the screening programs are key. Women between 40 and 64 who are uninsured or underinsured are eligible. And for them, this takes away worries of financial barriers. So, you know, you choose between do I get my mammogram, do I get my pap, or do I get my prescriptions. According to the Michigan Department of Community Health, breast cancer is the second leading cause of cancer deaths among Michigan women. In fact, last year alone, 1,320 women in the state died of this disease. <laughs> women are more likely to get breast cancer after age 40, but there are exceptions. I have stage 2B breast cancer and diagnosed at 32 years old. I have to have a full mastectomy and my um, lymph nodes taken out under my arm. Great, and I'm Linda Rom is a breast cancer survivor. Because of early detection, I didn't have to go through the extreme treatments that some people have to go through, so I feel pretty lucky. The former nurse now owns UP bras that fit, and she sells special mastectomy bras and breast forms. She reminds customers that the best defense is early detection. That's because 88% of women diagnosed will live at least 10 years longer with early detection. Yona Gavino, TV6 News, Escanaba.